As we prepare for the mid-season update in Apex, I can only be excited about Season 21, and there's many reasons why, so let me break down why I'm excited for Season 21, and after the mid-season update on Tuesday, we might see even more leaks for Season 21, as this is one of the big updates that prepares for the future of Apex. But next season is set up to bring us a new legend, which is believed to be Alter, who we actually saw some sneak peek gameplay of, and it makes sense that Alter is coming next season, as the season codename is Void, and she had Void-like abilities, and it seemed to be some kind of portal. But also, it's about time we get the brand new map, the district map, which is set in the E district of Suotamo, which is where Caustic's mother lives, who is also Crypto's adopted mother. And recently, a bunch of well-known creators actually got flew out to LA. And only they know what it was for, but it very well could have been to playtest or a press release for the next season, especially if it's bringing us a whole new legend and a whole new map. This is all stuff that they want to share with the content creators so that they can release their videos about it closer to season 21, which drops on May 6th, so that they can build hype for this. Also in season 21, it's rumored that we'll get more challenges like in season 20 to give us a reactive weapon. In season 20, we get the reactive flatline, but in season 21, if this is true, a credible source said we'd be getting an R99 reactive, but we could also be getting the Havoc reactive recolor, which you can see is still in the game files, so that could be the one set to go next season. But overall, with the new legend and the new map, and with these creators getting flown out to LA for something Apex related, it's hard not to believe that season 21 has been cooking for for a while. So let me know if you're excited to finally play on this new map that we've known about for over a year now, and if you're excited to potentially find out more from leaks in the mid-season patch on Tuesday.